Good morning, everybody. It's Saturday. I'm Byron Broussard in Atlanta, Georgia, and it's too early in the morning. I pray to God you had a great week. This is Saturday. It's the weekend time that you sort of reset. I hope you can have a little enjoyment, a little fun. The sun is shining. It's beautiful outside. Get out and get some vitamin D. Listen, just a little something. Just get you kicked off, get you started. Hope you got some juice or some coffee, a little water, something. But uh, a word. And it's found in the scripture, of course. Um, and if you look, you'll see it there. It's in 2 Kings chapter 2, verse 10. And uh, it's the words of a prophet to his protege. There's Elijah, and then there's Elisha who came behind him. This is what he said. Elisha was talking to the old man. And he said, uh, you know what? I, I'm, I'm following you and, and things are going pretty well. And the old man, in essence, asked him, what, what, you, what would you like? What you want me to do for you? He said, I want a double portion of what you got. He said, you king. Well, this is how it will happen. If you see me when I leave, when I go, then you can pick up my mantle and there'll be a double portion of my anointing in that act. What he was basically saying is, you have to wait a little longer. You have to rock with me a little longer. You have to go through what I go through a little longer. And if you stick around, if you hang, if you don't leave, if you don't take off, if you don't get frustrated, if you don't say the timing is bad, well, that brings me to my last thought. Purpose, preparation, and time of release are never going to be eliminated from God's equation. He's used it. He uses it throughout all the word. He uses it in relationships. It's purpose. All of us have one. But then there's a time of waiting. Jesus was 30 years old when his ministry started. He ministered for three years, and then he went to the cross and stepped off the earthly scene. 30 years of getting ready. 30 years of preparation. Can you wait? Can you wait five years? 10 years without getting too frustrated, 20 years, even 30 years, because God's purpose is right and real. His preparation is what you need, and his timing for your release is just perfect. Wait on him, pray to him, love him, trust him, respect him, clarify and purify your motives, and the Lord will use you to be a blessing. He said, if you see me when I go, boy, you can have what I have, a double portion it's too early in the morning. I pray you got something. It's Saturday. Get your groceries. Be careful. Put your mask on. Listen, this thing got serious. I may have put us on phase one again. Pay attention. Don't take your eye off the ball. Tomorrow, Sunday, all the saints are going to worship and praise God as a church. I hope you're there. 930 is when we do it at Love Center Atlanta. Peace, blessings, blessings.